Hey there everyone, this is Danielle, playing another Super Mario Maker 2 viewer level. Uh, I was invited to play this one made by Zoe at Sleeping Town, who is a cutie. Uh, here's the conversation. Uh, so yeah, the level code is S... Well, course ID, whatever. SXFF80KTF. Um, and I'm gonna see how it goes. Uh, boop. So yeah, I put the code in already, there we go. Uh, so, it's called Dosmas, Bouncy Bouncy, or Dosmas, or I'm not sure what the correct pronunciation is. Um, the clear rate is a little low. Um, we'll see how we go with it. Uh, I don't really know what to expect, but let's have a look. It's a smooth level, which is good, I like smooth. I don't know what the description means. I don't know what a bomb ladder is, so I may not be able to solve this puzzle. We'll see how we go. Okay, so we've got a power block there. Uh, I don't think I'm supposed to do that. I think, I think I'm supposed to catch the power block, maybe. Um, well, I can grab it like that, but then what? Um, I could stand on the power block, and that would let me go in the door if I had a key, but I, I don't have a key. Uh, is that Swamp over there a Maverick? Yes, that, that is a Maverick Swamp. Also, you can't spin on the chainsaw, the, the saw blades in, in this game, even though you can in Smooth, so that's annoying. Okay, this isn't, this isn't an auto-scroller, it's just bobbing up and down, I wasn't sure. Alright. Alright, so we have a power block here. I don't really know what I'm supposed to do with it. I guess I need a key, but I don't know where to get a key. Um, I hope if I knew what a bomb ladder is, because I don't. If I set this off, it actually happens. Oh, that's interesting. <laughs> Oops. Okay, so evidently this is a puzzle of some kind. As the, you know, the description indicated, it said it was a puzzle-solving level in the tags. Okay, so I can bounce it back off the spring like that. If I actually set it off like that, what happens? Hmm, not much. Maybe I need to move the booze. Because the, the booze will move if I look away, or maybe I can move them somewhere more helpful? Or, hang on, no, I think they might be stuck there because they're attached to the munches. Yeah. So if I kill the munches, the booze can move, but I don't know if that helps me. Maybe it does. Um, let's find out. Where did the power block go? See, I can move them like this, but then... Then what? Can I spin jump on booze in this game? No. I can't remember if you can do that in Smoo or not. I am very confused. It's possible I just don't know the mechanic I'm supposed to be using here. I'm not really an expert on 2D Mario's. I think I need to kill something with the with the Maverick. I feel like I can probably kill these booze with the Maverick Swamp and one of them probably has the key, but to make them to get them to come up here, I need to use the power block. Um and if I need to use the power block, I can't then, you know, have the power block to stand on using the spring. Which is why I'm a little confused here. Let's see. Let's throw it up. Okay, so I can catch it again. And I can accidentally do that. So once the booze can move, I think... I think I can 
get them high enough that the Maverick Swamp will kill them. But... Then I need to go over there to activate the Maverick Swamp, and I don't really have any platforms left. Hmm... This is looking tricky. Uh, let me see... Okay, so I've got my, got my power here. I think, I think there's something, a trick you can do to activate a power without losing it? I, I think that's my, I think that's what you need to do, but I don't know what the trick is. Um, so I'm gonna try catching it as it hits the ground, maybe? No, that didn't. I don't think I can grab it that way. Hmm. 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 <laughs> I am really not sure what I should be doing. Um. Uh, Zoe did tell me that the level involves power catching. I don't know what that is. Um, presumably it's something to do with the, the power you know, you throw it and then you catch it, but I, I don't know what effect that has. Like, my guess is if you catch it with the right timing, it'll, like, set off and then you can keep it, because that's what I think you need to do, but I don't really know what the timing would be. I guess I'll just try to throw it up and catch it and see if I can do it right. Nope. See, that time it just went off normally. Maybe I need to look up this, this concept of power catching. Uh, I got my browser open, so I'll just go power catching. Um... Well, none of these things are to do with Mario Maker, so I might need to say Mario Power Catching. <laughs> no, that didn't even work. Um, I'm I'm a very confused. Can I get close enough to activate the swamp? Oh, hang on, the swamp can't get through the spring. This one actually can't get over here because of the springs. I didn't realize that. Hmm. Maybe I meant to jump to activate the Maverick and then catch the power block? Or, I don't know. Oh. Okay, that's not right. Hang on, if I, if I throw the power block and then jump onto it... I can get over there and then get sprung back, right? I don't know if activating the Maverick helps me at all, though, because the spring there stops it from coming any closer. Like, if I throw it, and then... Okay, I need a bit more of a run-up. Okay, there's actually a block down there at the bottom of the screen. I just pointed at it. You can't see that. Because, you know, I'm doing, I do that in real life, and I'm not capturing it, but... Alright, so, yeah, I'm thinking if I throw the POW and then jump onto it... Okay, yeah, I think that I think that's what I need to do. Maybe, maybe. But then not slip off. Um, I think I need to let go of the run button after landing on it. Basically, that's my guess anyway. But I need to be running a little bit so that I can actually land on it.
See, there's like a special sound effect playing when I get over there, so I think that's a hint. Some dexterity required for this puzzle to work, by the looks of things. It's just a little frustrating. <laughs> Oops. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, there's definitely, like, sound effects associated with those springs over there that activate when I touch them, so... Maybe... Hmm. Maybe I'm meant to jump onto it as it comes back instead of as it goes over there so the spring won't bounce me off? It doesn't seem to help. Now I've lost the power blocks, so... Okay, I think those springs are moving a little bit? From being hit with the... Are they? Or is that what they started? <sighs> hmm. Hmm. Yeah, they are moving. They were lined up, and, and then they weren't, so... Definitely does, that does something. Let me just experiment here. Okay, so I can throw it like that. It bounces off the spring, it comes back. I can catch it again. So it doesn't have any effect, is the problem. Um, okay, that guy's active now, or he was a moment ago. And that did move the springs over a little bit. So maybe, I, maybe that's what I'm meant to be doing? Moving the springs closer by jumping on the pal? Uh, now I've lost it. Hmm. This is a really confusing level. <laughs> okay, grab the power block. Okay, throw. Bounce. Jump on the power block. Catch the power block. See, the Maverick Fomp actually moved those springs across a little bit. My theory is if I keep doing that, the springs will slide off that spike, and then they'll fall, because springs are affected by gravity, and then uh, the swamp is free to come over here and annoy me, uh, and also to kill the booze, which is what I actually want. Ugh. This seems like a hassle. <laughs> um, Alright, let me just uh, grab that power block. There we go. Okay, so release the power block. Jump on the power block in order to get close enough to activate the swamp. Then repeat. Okay, that time I didn't get close enough, I think, because the power... Oops. Yeah, um, because the spring moves, the power doesn't go quite as far, I think, is the problem. Uh... Okay, so if I walk a bit back here and do the same thing... Oops. Well, power block's gone. I feel like there should be a pipe or something to give you another power block, but I suppose that would make the puzzle of how to do this without losing the power block trivial, so... I don't know. About here... No, don't that... Why did I do that? Foolish Danny, that's not what you're supposed to do. This is a hard level. Um, I think I understand, like, what I'm trying to achieve now. It's just execution is also very tricky.
Okay, so me standing on that block that didn't actually activate the swamp, which is not good. That time it did, but then I died. Um... Yeah, it's definitely doing what I want it to. It's just very, very slow. There. Okay, so now I believe I just activate the power block. Uh. Oh! Okay, so I have a key, so I don't activate the power block. I just had to drop the springs. That's all I had to do. Alright, so I'll just drop the power... Really? 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 Oh, okay. <laughs> the door looks like it's in midair. I thought I had to drop the power on it, but... Oh, wow. Okay. So that was an interesting puzzle. <sighs> Took me a minute. I don't know why Soft Snow said easy. It was not easy. That execution was really tricky. So, yeah. um, The, the basic puzzle is that you need to get close to the Maverick Swamp to activate it. The way you do that is by throwing a power block and then jumping on it as it comes back. Fair enough. I was sure you would have to actually kill the booze with the Maverick Swamp, so it's interesting that you don't. Hmm. I suppose it, there'd be no way to get back over once you'd activated it to let the booze move. Hmm. Anyway, uh, that's, uh, that's, uh, Dos Mass Bouncy Bouncy. A little puzzle level by Zoe, who is cute. Um, I hope you enjoyed. Um, I liked it. Like I said. <laughs> um, but it was, it was hard. Um, because I'm not good at video games. Uh, but I enjoyed it. Uh, and it only took me, what, 17 minutes to figure it out? So it's, it's not bad. That's not bad. 